feelers now or that I don't mind any quarterback or what happens then when it comes time in the fall, I could say I was always on this quarterback side. Okay, so you have a clip somewhere. Yeah. Saved in the chamber. Yeah. He said, remember, it was March 6th, Wednesday, where we Pac-Man was back. Yeah. <laughs> this is before he even released Stand on Business, That's which right. changed the trajectory of Bingo. his entire rap career. Mm-hmm. I was saying, Just Dustin Fields of Pittsburgh. Yeah. yeah. Love oh. Justin. Justin Fields in the story. Baker Mayfield's in the story. Yep. Kirk Cousins is in the story. Russell Wilson's in the story. Yep. Caleb Williams is in the story. Mm-hmm. Jaden Daniels is in the story. Matt what? Jones now, maybe. Yep. Mac Jones, potentially in the story. If you're listening to 2.30 a.m. conversations that are taking place around Indianapolis bars during Combine. Who doesn't? Is in the story. Uh, Michael Penix is yeah, in, yeah. in, yeah. in the story all of a sudden. JJ McCarthy. Yeah. JJ it's, McCarthy. it's like, it, it's very, how many spots are there? Plus, you know? Not that when, many. Yeah, how not many that sp- many. So whenever you, whenever you think wow. about Russell Wilson, Baker Mayfield, and I don't, I assume your thoughts on Baker or the way they are. He had a great year last year. He did. He did. He did. Hey, yeah, hey, he did. hey he Baker, way to go. Well, Seems to find himself to play his best football last year. I'm assuming he's very excited. Everybody's saying Tampa's trying to keep him. He's going to be a Buccaneer. New England Patriots with Mac Jones, seemingly potential quarterback situation. Pittsburgh Steelers, Kenny Pickett's coming back. He's the starter going in there, but people think quarterback situation. Yes. Denver Broncos, everybody's thinking now, obviously quarterback situation. Mm -hmm. Las Vegas Raiders, quarterback Mm -hmm. situation. Chicago Bears, obviously, with it, quarterback situation. It's like, there's a lot of... Throw Jimmy G in there. What's that? Throw Jimmy G in there when you mention the Raiders. Okay, Mm -hmm. Jimmy G. He's out there, right? How many spots, you know, somebody's going to miss out. Russ to the Raiders. Somebody's definitely going to miss out. You you talk about Justin Field, you go back and say, what do Chicago want for Justin Field? No one is giving Chicago a one for Justin Field. So you think about it, all right, so what's fair, I guess... Uh, two originally, but they're saying it's it's less than that. Yeah, now. yeah, yeah. Because the market, because Russell Wilson, yeah. exactly. Cut, mm-hmm. like, yeah. So now Justin Fields, it's like a four. He's being compared to Legit. the rest of the market that's yeah. out there right now, plus the rookies. Yeah. In there. yeah. So like Justin Fields being compared to two different complete markets. AJ, what you say there, dude? What about Russ to the Raiders? Why haven't we mentioned that at all? I think the reason why, and I mentioned this yesterday to Lombo, um, like the Raiders feel like they're trying to get back to the Raider way. Mm-hmm. And I, for some reason, I just I don't know if Russ is a but Russ is a talent. Yeah, Russ, yeah. If you yeah. go in there and win, who cares? You know, I guess he's affordable. Yeah, he's affordable, and you could count on him at least for two years, don't you think? And he'll show up. Yeah, yeah. You know, he'll show he'll up every there. single day. He'll be a good leader. They were one of the original teams when he left Seattle that he put on his list. And I know it like it's not, but like the Sierra connection residency. with this, yeah, like a Vegas residency. Like I think that was initially pitched. It's like okay, well, she would be on board with like moving their family there and everything. As what, well. are songs? what are some of Sierra's songs? What are some of Sierra's songs? I'd know them if I heard them. I couldn't loosen name. Them. Let me see you She's one a, two step. Oh, yeah, 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 there it is. She's got some hips. Yeah. 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 Oh no, they smoking cigars in 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 in. in. In Vegas, I don't know if he fit that one. <laughs> but oh. but he could. smoking big cigars. That's what, that's what I'm saying. Like the Raider, I don't know. Like Raider way, I don't think Russell Wilson immediately. But personally, it could be revenge Russ. Like what if he just yeah. does a 180 yep. and he just says, oh, you know be. what, heal Russ. I'm gonna be the baddest mother <laughs> what if, in this what if, entire. Yeah. Movie. He does come walk. What if there's like a full on? Yeah. You know, uh, bit, yeah, pissed. He's yeah. wearing like cut off now. Shirt, yeah. his, his team three social media assistant manager puts a video out of him walking next to his Bentley oh, Rolls yeah. Royce. You know? Hollywood Hogan painted on beers, yeah. sunglasses. sunglasses. Yeah, they yeah. yeah. oh. give a PowerPoint on like Roman Reigns and the Bloodline. Like, hey, this is what we're thinking for your next season. <laughs> Revenge, Russ. Yes. Just like how The Rock had a 21 minute promo. Wait, yep. Do you think where he, he said fudge your story yeah. to Cody Rhodes? Yeah. Russell Wilson walks out of that house, <laughs> does his thing, and goes up to the camera and goes, Fudge Sean Payton. Yeah. Oh, my God. Connor kind of oh. suggested that Team 3 is pitching oh. Russ on, on pitch decks where his next location should be and what the storyline in his character should be at that location. Agreed. He's a yeah. movie character. Yeah. Revenge Russ is not a bad chap. Yep, exactly. Not at all. And he can still, he can still go to Minnesota. And what if he Russ. comes out with an action? What if he's featured... Pac, would you put him on? Yeah, no. please. Yeah. Well, yeah, come on. Pac, put on SOB on the song. Remix on SOB. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Let, him on, let, him on, let him on stand on business. St- standing on like a wax figure of Sean Payton, oh. Russell Wilson. No, Russ, what Russ would do is if it, was, it would actually be the words business spelled out. Like yeah. 15 feet Boom. tall. Yep. Yeah. Boom. Business. And he would just be walking across the top. Mm-hmm. Of Massive letter. <laughs> yeah. And standing and man, walking on business. Mm-hmm. You know, as he's doing He's that. standing yeah. on business. What are you getting paid not to play right now? 39 million. Woo! He can dance, too. SOB. Hey, he did. Uh, he dance well. That's an incredible. Unbelievable. 
before even touching the field over there, signs a five-year extension that he mm -hmm. won't even make it to with his original contract yep. ending before he was let go from the team. Mm -hmm. He now can literally go anywhere and play for $1.2 million. Yep. And there's going to be a lot of teams. And, yeah. you know, you, you walk around and you talk about stuff. And we at the Combine, and we on here just say the salary cap's fake. Mm -hmm. It is. And I know there's a lot of people that have gone on board with that. And we were just a tiny little internet show whenever we were yelling that from the top of the mountains yeah. mm -hmm. about salary cap gymnastics that can take place. If your team wants a player, they can figure mm -hmm. out how to leverage the future yeah. into keeping the player. And then they can kick the can down the road, they say. Kick the can down the road. You're going to have to get that can sometime. But then as soon as you get there, guess what you can do again? You can just kick that son of a bitch again. Yep. Yep. And then all of a sudden, you're just working up a strength in your leg, and you're kicking that same can 10 to 15 times down right. the road. Yep. Mm -hmm. Inevitably, you're going to have to get there. But as the salary cap continues to grow by $30 million from one year right. to the next, it's like the contracts that you sign for the future or the can that you kick in the future can fit in a lot easier whenever you decide to move on. Like... The $85 million that the Denver Broncos uh -huh. are choosing not to have access to so that they can move on from Russell Wilson, that's a massive number. Obviously, 35-6 and 49-4 or 35-4, mm -hmm. 49-6, whatever the math is there for the 6 and the 4 becoming the whole to make this thing the $85 million, whatever it is. It's like that's a wild move. But I assume in Sean Payton's eyes, he thinks maybe the salary cap's going to jump again. So, like, that that next $49, 6000000 it's like obviously a lot, but still a lot of money to build a team with.